Hey guys, today I'm doing a review of my newest custom doll, my Bella Dalla dolls. Bella Dalla is one of those artists out there that really takes the pull-up mold and makes it her own. She's known for her uh, carving work, the noses, the lips. She just, she really changes the look of a pull-up doll. So you can see my gorgeous girl here. Let's see, her name is Salome, Salome. Um, I fell in love with this doll the minute I saw her picture on Instagram because she's been made to look like she's crying. So I'll, I'll get a close up of her face in a little bit. But what's really cool about Bella Dalla is she kind of does everything head to toe. Now she doesn't make the wig, but I think she makes the eye chips, the outfits, the shoes. I mean, you're talking full custom, like she, no joke, full custom. And each one of her dolls is very, very different. And one of the cool things about Bella Dalla is that she does take commissions. So in addition to selling the dolls, she also will, she'll take an order from you and you can get exactly what you want. But I didn't have to do that because I saw this girl on Instagram and about died. Um, so let me start by talking about um, her stock and then I'll talk about her face up. So like I mentioned, the artist does create everything, just about everything, uh, including this little handbag, which I think is so cute with the heart, the little dress, I think I added the, uh, the necklace, but the, the cute little dress. She comes with white stockings and then these adorable black boots. And then in addition to the dress, she has the matching hair bow. Um, as for the doll itself, this one comes with this brown, you know, I love, you know, I love a good brunette doll. Uh, I love that she comes in these braids. I think there's something about having the hair out of the doll's kind of face and not covering her that I think is very special. And then the face, oh my goodness, she is, she's got some attitude, this one. So she's got these kind of fuller brows, these beautiful big blue eyes, a very natural looking uh, freckle pattern on her face. And you can see, I don't know if you can see around her eyes, she does look like she's crying. And you know whenever you see uh, like small children crying and their face gets kind of pink? And I think that's the expression she's trying to capture here. Like she's just cried herself a little bit into a fit and she's got these pink cheeks. And you can see the carving work, kind of extensive carving work that's been done on the nose and the lips. She's even got this bottom lip where she's almost kind of, she's trying not to cry. I mean, my goodness, this doll is adorable. And it's so funny because when I put her next to my other pull-ups, she doesn't even look like a pull-up anymore. So just so cute. Now let me show you her eyelids. This is another place where I think the artist really shines. Uh, so Solome here has these gorgeous striped eyelids. And I'm going to give you my first impression of them. Do you remember there was this, um, there was this gum? When I was a little kid, it was like this super sugary bubble gum and it was called fruit stripe or fruit. I can even envision it, it was like a zebra. So anyway, um, and it came in all these flavors and I feel like her eyelids look like, <laughs> look like that gum. Actually it makes me wanna pack right now. I wonder if I can get it online. Uh, anyway, so like I mentioned, Bella Dalla does a lot of different dolls. She actually makes her own wigs now. I think she does do um, like a cruelty-free uh, mohair wig. You should check out her Etsy page and also her Instagram. But if you have any questions about Bella Dalla, please let me know. Thanks.